welcome to my channel in this tutorial i am going to show you how to import and export a file in your database okay let's get start first of all you have to create database i use default database postgres and check your extension for this purpose i need postgis extension so uh, you have to create it from query query tool okay it will open a query editor tool uh, window and then write create extension create extension for gis okay then run it Query returned successfully. Okay, then if you refresh it, you can see it here. Post GIS. In this video, I will first of all import the save file in database and then export it. I use public schema. Uh, my save file are here in desktop postgis folder and nepal data i will use this district set file for this go to search menu here and type post gis set file db loader dbf loader click it this is the default tool uh, when you install post uh, grace sql uh, and post GIS extension it will automatically download it in your laptop PC then first of all you have to connect this with your database for this my username is post grace password admin database password and server host local host okay it is and database name database name is postgres okay postgres then click ok it will connect your database with this tool then you can simply add a file uh, data district.ssp make sure the file is .ssp and then open okay then simply clicking import so you can see these files on your database okay click ok okay then minimize it refresh here okay tables i'll see district table here cp district from from run this query okay this will print out the output you can see your geometry type in postgres 10 plus version see it okay this is it the nepal district files okay i will export these files into my local directory by just okay go to export and then a table table i have two table district and raster column i add district table and then click export choose a folder output and make sure the file is .ssv file you can make it 
.dbf file if it does not contain geometry and geography column click ok ok data is exported to our local directory output here you can see uh, see district set files in this way you can import and uh, export data in database thank you for watching